We are recording. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is Edna J. White, and this is What About This? This is your destination to hear amazing people tell their lovely stories about their lovely lives that they love to love other people. So I'm going to give them 15 minutes to real talk about real things with real people. Now, this next guest has been with me. I've known her. And she is a powerhouse. I kind of like to keep it quiet for a little bit because she will take over. She's the best, though. She is the best. She has a heart full of gold, and she has some information for us today. I kind of want to say Shirley, but I'm going to say a whole name. Shirley Singletary Hudson. No hyphen, okay? No hyphen. Keeping it real. No hyphen. She claims all of that. And I'm going to introduce her right now, and she's going to share her business. Shirley Singletary Hudson, take it away. Well, thank you so very, very much. My sister, Edna, <laughs> and she got it right to a T. Shirley Singletary Hudson without a hyphen. So does she know me? Okay. That's what I'm talking about. Well, I got 15 minutes, okay? And you know, 15 minutes goes by very, very fast. But let me just share with you, the audience. Uh, I call myself a serialpreneur. <gasps> and I'll tell you why. Because of the fact that we all know that we're not going to make our million or be wealthy just from one source of income. Right. So let me just tell you. My husband and I, we own together a travel business, which is Search World Global Travel. And okay. you can find us on the internet. The second thing that I do is a health and wellness, okay? And we're going to talk a little bit about that business tonight. And then the third one is that I'm an inspirational speaker. So the health and wellness and inspirational speaker kind of go hand in hand. We got to inspire each other, right? right. So those are the three businesses that I own. And I might have some more coming up. Like, who knows, right? That's right. Let's cereal, have... cereal. <laughs> So, you know, let's let's talk about the business I was telling you about health and wellness. You know, I was talking to Edna earlier before we started the live broadcast, you know, in terms of when we talk about health and wellness, we always seem to think about the physical, the outside, you know, how we yeah. want to look. This new word that I found, though, I'm not going to tell you my age, but this new word I heard about, snatched, okay? So, you know, a lot of people want to get snatched. So... What is snatch? You know, but now I know what it means. So, <laughs> but being healthy and being well does not only being mean being snatched. Right. It's not just the outside. You know, right. we can use the term snatched again, but let's use snatch for the inside. Yes. Let's snatch it up. Let's tighten it up. You know what I'm saying? And then also spiritually. We need to snatch some of them beliefs in line, All right. right? So, you know, all of this goes together. And so what I want to share with you is my business, Your Road to Living. And my Your Road to Living encompasses all of those three businesses, the travel component, mm -hmm. the health and wellness component, right. and also the inspirational component. Yes. And the, if you take these three roads, it is your road to living. So mm -hmm. that's how you can find me, your road to living. So what I want to share with you is this, is, is that I sell health products. They work. But the bottom line is, in order for them to work on the outside, we got to do something about that inside. All right. We got to clean that for stuff sure. that junk out the trunk. That's right. We sure. got to get that gut right, right right so now i'm talking to all those who are meat eaters i'm also talking to those who are vegan you know i'm talking about those you know who are they call it plant life who only you know eat we got all that but the bottom line is is that if you can't do nothing if you ain't got that inside right mm -hmm. you got to detox your body right okay but as you're detoxing your body we need to do some personal development Mm -hmm. See, we're going, when we talk about a makeover, and we, let's talk, let me talk to the women right now, man. Just give me a minute. <laughs> <laughs> you know, when us women, we want to go for a makeover. Our makeover is physical. You know, we go get the face done, all made up, the eyelashes, all that stuff. Okay. 
but I'm talking about a full makeup. I'm not talking about that outside stuff. I'm talking about feeding yourself. See, we're a vessel. Right. And then what we have to do is that we have to be a clean vessel. Right. So what we have to do in not only what we're putting inside of our bodies, but also what we're putting inside our minds. That's right. So, you know, we have to start reading some positive books. That's right. You know, that's going to move us to another level. We have to get in alignment. Okay? Right. I'm, I'm working real hard. I'm, I'm mm -hmm. being honest. I'm being transparent. I'm working real hard to get in alignment with my God. Yeah. Okay? Because the bottom line, whoever you believe in, I'm not saying everybody believes in God, but whoever, whoever you, you need to be in alignment. Right. When you're in alignment, there is nothing negative that comes through and all things happen that are good. That's right. Think that you don't even have to put any effort to. That's right. Okay? <laughs> so what I'm talking about here is, is that we need to get in alignment. Mm -hmm. So get your book. Spend 15 minutes a day whether it's morning, afternoon, or evening, 15 minutes, that's all. Feed yourself spiritually, professionally, okay, personally. Then what we can do is start now cleaning that stuff out of our bodies. Mm -hmm. Let me give you an example. So think of your inside of your body. Mm -hmm. So let's say you put something in the garbage and the garbage wasn't picked up and it's a hot day. Mm -hmm. So what's happening to the stuff in the garbage? Smell. Mm -hmm. It's getting spoiled. Right. And then it doesn't go away until the garbage man comes, right? That's right. That's the same thing with your inside of your body. Yeah. That's why you have to detox. That mm -hmm. stuff is just sitting up in it. I don't care what you eat. That's right. Don't no care matter what, what you eat. Yeah. No matter what. You got to take something to move that stuff on out. You can right. be a little lighter and a little happier. <laughs> so that's a whole what lot I do. <laughs> yes, yes, a whole lot happier. So the bottom line is with the product, when I talk about the health and wellness, the name of my company are the products I sell and represent is Total Life Changes. And that's exactly what we do is that we total do a total life. Say it again, total? Total Life Changes. Great, okay. And that's, that's our product. My website is your, Y-O-U-R, Road. R O A D, the number two living, L I V I N G dot com. Great. Go check out my site. You know, go check me out. Come and support me. But the bottom line, I'm going to tell you, I don't call myself a rep. I call my my, myself a solution maker. Right. Because I have a solution for you. If mm -hmm. I don't have a solution for you, don't worry. I'm going to try. If I know somebody who has a solution for you, I'm going to refer you. Right. Because see, as I said early, it really is about being in alignment. You have to get to a point where you want to help others. Right. And, and then now we're talking about that. You know, I'm not talking right. about, you know, uh, what they say about the past is about the money and stuff like that. That's not what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. But I'm telling you, give from, you give from the heart that That's you right. want to help somebody. Mm -hmm. And when you do that, and it's coming from the heart. You will get something that comes back to you. I can't tell you in what form. Yeah. But something will you come will back. Give back exactly. back. It will come back to you. Back. You know, so just because you gave somebody $50, okay, and you expect for them to give you the $50 back, and you already knew they weren't going to pay you back That's anyway. Right. You have to That's do right. it from the heart because it doesn't matter if they did or not. Exactly. Right? Exactly. So, you know, we have to do better. So what I want to say to you, is that with our health, we have to not only think of our physical body, but we have to, like I said before, our mental and our spiritual. That's right. So what I want to do, go ahead, go ahead, Edna, what you say? So I want to, I want to bring out, see, Shirley hasn't told you guys that she <laughs> actually is a product of her product. I want her to explain that. Explain. Oh, okay. Um, you know what, a short story. I started this product about really about three years ago. Mm -hmm. And somebody told me, okay, you sure you need to try this product. And I said, well, why? They said, well, you'll lose five pounds in five days. Said, yeah, tell me something. <laughs> so, uh, they said, really? It's all organic and you do it. So to make a long story short, what I did is I tried the tea. And the tea worked. 
I didn't lose five pounds though. I lost seven pounds in the first five days. Wow. Okay. And it, what I liked about it, it had no caffeine, so they had no craft cr uh, cramping. Yeah. Rush to the bathroom. If you go regularly, that's the way it's going to go. It's going to come through right. regularly. So what happened was is that I continued to do that. And then I've never been a vitamin taker. But I saw people taking 10 and 12 little pills for vitamins. I said, oh, no. <laughs> I can't take no vitamins. I'm not dropping no 12 pills. But Total Life Changes had a liquid multivitamin. Uh -huh. So what I did was, I said, well, let me try that. So I tried it. I liked it because look, I am getting the equivalent of 10 salads in one tablespoon. Nice. And it goes directly into your bloodstream. Nice. Nice. So after I saw those two products work, and somebody said, someone had told me that, you know what? It helped me get off my blood pressure medication. Nice. Well, I happen to be on two medications. I happen to be on my blood pressure medication and also cholesterol medication. Okay. My goal change. My goal change is I wanted to get off the medication. Right, right. So what happened was I had a doctor's appointment already. I went in and he said, your blood work looks good. He said, let's, let's go another 30 days. I went another 30 days, still just taking the tea and the Nutriburst. And he said, your numbers are looking real good. He said, why don't we do this? And I asked him, said, can I get my medication? He said, this is what we'll do. We'll take you off of your cholesterol medication. Nice. So Yes, very nice. Mm. Yeah. nice. Yeah. So then after I did that, I started taking the resolution drops. Okay, resolution drops curbs your appetite right. as well as you lose between, depending on your body type, one to three pounds per day. Wow. Yes. So I added that to my regimen. And I have to tell you, I lost 35 pounds in a month. Yes. Yeah. Now and now I am going. I'm now, you know, I'm on this journey. I'm on this journey. I, I have a goal that I want to reach. And what I want to share with you about this weight loss is, is that when I initially started the weight loss journey, I didn't change my eating habits. I was okay. still eating French fries. I was still eating French fries and yeah. <laughs> and still, still dropping weight. Still dropping weight. Mm -hmm. So what happened? So what happened was is when I add the resolution drop, it did curb my appetite, but also subconsciously, I believe that I was very conscious of what I was putting into my body. Right. Became very conscious. Right. That's exactly. Right. So then I went back to the doctor, and guess what? I got on my high blood pressure medication. Nice. So I am not on exactly. any. That's very nice. So I'm not saying you know I'm not claiming any medical claims. Uh, nor income claim, uh, claims, but what I am saying to you, that's what it has done for me. Nice. You got so where can we find this? Where can we find this again? Tell us again so we can you be can clear. Go to your, Y-O-U-R, road, R-O-A-D, the number two, okay. living, L-I-V-I-N-G dot com. Okay. And how can we find you if we don't, here that, that that website, how can we find you on any social media? Okay, on Facebook, you can yes. find me at Shirley Singletary Hudson. Hear that? I said <laughs> <laughs> And also no hyphen. No hyphen. No hyphen. That's right. <laughs> tell them, tell them, tell them, Linda. And then uh, and then you can find me on IG, Instagram. And that's oh. gonna be Shirley Sing Instagram. Now Instagram is where? What's gonna be? Shirley. Dot Singletary. Beautiful. Well, Shirley, this has been an eye opener for me. And you know, I'm all about, I'm not a foodie, but I'm all about eating healthy. And I'm happy that I'm eating healthy. I mean, I've been discovering things through this pandemic, which I know you have. And yes. I'm like so happy because my body is 100% better. I feel like I'm 20. <laughs> Oh, oh. No, I really do. I feel like I'm 20 and it's changed me just the eating habits. And I, like I told you, my, my friend, um, she also does, does what you do. And I've been taking that. And I feel the vitamins, are, it's the liquid that you're saying. It's the liquid. That's correct. It's the liquid. And the spelling is so very important. Oh my goodness. It's so yeah.
getting that yeah. out and getting it over with is so very important. But got to. so excited about you and your products and the love because now you are the product. See, see, this is a this is a, this is someone who is living the product. Yes, That's the whole thing, her story. Make you run out and go. Let me go start or go online and find Shirley Single Terry Hudson without the hyphen. Find her <laughs> and get it and get started. You know because there's no surgeries during the pandemic. Hey. <laughs> so you gotta eat right and you gotta live healthy. And she can inspire you as well as give you the right things to put in your body. Yes. This is Edna J. White signing off with Shirley Singletary Hudson without the hyphen. Thank you, Edna. You're welcome. <laughs>